welcome to Mr. 414 News, and uh, we have a special guest with us here today. Uh, he took some time out of his schedule to come speak with the community. I would like you all to welcome Mr. Strauss Zelnick, Chairman of Take Two Interactive Software Incorporated. And like I said before, he took some time out of his busy schedule to answer some questions for us, and we're glad to have him here. I guess the first question would be about the NHL 2K series, which had a humble beginning and some successes, even though many regarded it as an arcade-style hockey game versus the sim style of the NHL series by EA Sports. Strangely, though, NHL 2K11 was for the Wii only, and never made it to the 360 or the PS3. After a one-year hiatus, you announced that NHL 2K12 would not be released on any console, putting an end to the NHL series of video games. My question is, will the beloved series be making a return to the ice, or was it the rise of competition that caused you to close the doors on the NHL 2K series, leaving many 2K hockey fans holding the bag? Your response. Uh, that didn't answer the question, Mr. Strauss, but uh, let's continue. The next question is in regards to the NCAA 2K College Hoop series that started in 2002, and like the NHL series, they enjoyed some great success from 2K3 leading up to 2K8. But in a typical 2K fashion, you canceled the College Hoops 2K9, which was scheduled for a November 2008 release. This decision was made due to the fact that negotiations had soured between your company and the CLC. Now, to our viewers out there who don't know who the CLC is, that's the collegiate licensing company which holds trademarks for more than 200 colleges and universities. After the deal soured, you want a record to say that we're committed to providing fans with high-quality, critically acclaimed sports games. So my question must be, what steps are being taken internally within Take-Two Interactive to mend those burn bridges with the CLC and bring back the beloved College Hoops franchise from the dead? Your response, please, Mr. Strauss. Uh, Mr. Strauss, I think the community would appreciate it if you answer our questions directly, but let's continue. Recently, you come out and said that you're not going to renew the MLB license. Now, this doesn't come much of a surprise to me, given your track record of abandoning sports franchises. It's also been confirmed that your company was losing $30 million a year on the licensing deal you signed back in 2005 to counter EA's NFL licensing deal signed that same year. But in typical 2K fashion, you're canceling the series without putting up much of a fight. You even gone on record to say that your company wants to concentrate solely on original IPs, IPs such as Borderlands 2, a great title, Bioshock Infinite, also going to be a great game, and Grand Theft Auto 5, respectively under the 2K banner. My question is, did the competition make you bow out? Will the MLB series be making the return to the diamond? Or is this a sign of the doors closing on the 2K Sports Division for the last time? Your response. Mr. Strauss, we would appreciate a response, not dead silence, but let's continue. My last question is in relation to the NFL licensing deal that took place in 2004-2005. The NFL put up the licensing for bid. EA was among five software publishing companies, Take-Two Interactive being one of those five. So all five companies had an equal shot at obtaining the license. My question is to you, why Take-Two Interactive wasn't more assertive in obtaining the license, or was the cost too high to invest that sense of loyalty to the fans that invest that same loyalty to you? Your response. That's all the time we have here today at Mr. 414 News. We'd like to thank Mr. Strauss Zelnick for joining us in the studio and answering questions. This is Mr. 414 signing off saying, if you can't beat him, just quit it. I really can't agree that the standard was taken away from 2K when 2K never really fought to keep that standard from the get-go. I even hear in some circles that Madden will never be a 2K football game. Interesting. Well, we never thought man would land or walk on the moon, but we got there, didn't we? Think about it.
anything's possible. Besides, blue teas really aren't my thing. I prefer a white tea. Holla at your boy.